Hi guys, so we are back with another video and today we are not going to be hunting, we are not going to be fishing but we are going to make uh, something special. The winter is approaching, it's gonna be cold and today we're going to make some mittens. And uh, we got a lot of pelts over the years where we collect from the coyotes, foxes, bobcats, what we harvest and uh, we have a beautiful pelts what we're gonna use and we got coyote pelts which are nicely done, show Patrick. Montana coyote and red We fox. got Montana coyotes and uh, red foxes, then we have uh, eastern coyotes and then we have, yeah, a lot of beautiful pelts. So from this... You can make some beautiful mittens. Beautiful mittens. So we got nice old sewing machine. What are we going to use? We just picked it up the other day. It's a, it's a bonus never stop for a machine, so we'll use that and uh, we're going to cut it. Cut it open. We're going to cut it in a half, open it up, we're going to uh, stretch it, let it dry overnight and tomorrow we'll, uh, we'll start making the mittens. Alright guys, so we have our beautiful coyote pelts, they are nice and prime, would be harvest. I believe those are from Montana and we have lots of them. Yeah, we have a few boxes of these, but the pelts are very, very nice. So we're going to open them, uh, split them open. We're going to water them, stretch them, let them dry out. And then we're going to make a beautiful pair of mittens, maybe even more than one pair. We're going to make a lot of pairs of mittens. And if you are interested, we can make one for you too. Spray the pelt a little bit with some just normal water in a bottle. Normal water, yeah. Soak it in. Water is gonna absorb inside the pelt a little bit. We'll stretch it. We started. I'm gonna put. We put a three nails right here on top of the head to just hold the pelt. And what we'll do now? We'll just pull the pelt. I'm just going inch by inch by inch and the pelt is just growing and growing and growing. So that's how you stretch it. So we'll pull with a couple nails right here in the back for the push pins and then we'll go all the way around. Okay. Well done. So the pelt is nice and stretched. We got one more to do. We'll stretch another one. We'll let it sit, dry out. We'll come later on, pick them up, and we're gonna make a beautiful pair of mittens. Guys, our pelts have dried. They're nice and stretched. So now we're gonna pull the pins out and go to our sewing room and cut out some templates and sew some mittens. Let's do it. <music> Coyote pelt stretched up, so now let's go in our basement and cut some templates. Hey guys, so uh, we are ready to cut our templates. We are ready to start sewing. So we got everything lined up. We got our templates, and uh, we got the fur ready. You're gonna cut it right on top of the leather. The fur has some holes, so we're trying to avoid it, and uh, just pick the nice nice pieces of leather i mean the whole fur is beautiful just like i said i mean we're not gonna waste it even if there's some holes then later on we're just gonna sew it together and we're gonna use it for more and more mittens <music> This is gonna be the top of the mitten. Look at that. It's so fluffy. Tell me, your hand is gonna be nice and cozy in these. 
We got pretty good uh, damage to our beautiful pelt, but we got all the pieces here cut out. Now for the palm, we're gonna use a deer leather, and that's gonna be just for the palm of the of the mitten. And then once this is all sewed together, we're gonna use the liner for inside the mitten, so your fingers are not gonna be touching just the bare Stickers. leather. Which I mean, it's still gonna keep you warm, but the liner gonna feel your hand nice and cozy. So this is our deer skin for the palm of the of the mitten. I need my marker. Um, magic marker. Magic marker. And we'll do the left. Left palm and the right palm. Alright guys, so we're gonna start sewing. We got everything ready, line up. This is our old bonus never stop working fur machine, which works just fantastic. You're gonna take care of the machine, the machine is gonna take care of you. And uh, yeah, let's start sewing. I got my palm and the thumb. That's the first thing what I'm gonna start working on. After that, we're just gonna add on and add on and uh, we'll be done before you know it. All right, so let's do it. Ah, okay. This is gonna be our thumb. Look at that. <laughs> nice and nice soft, one, right? fluffy. Nice. So the palm is done. Uh, now we just flip the thumb. Flip the thumb. And uh, this is our palm. This is our palm. This is gonna be the back of the back of the mitten. Look at that. How, how beauty. All right, let's sew it up. That's it. All right, guys, so we got front and back all together and now we're gonna sew them together so you gotta be sewing them fur inside the fur is touching and you have a letter on the both side then once you're done you're just gonna flip them over and that's your final product so we saw we sewed our full mitten together so now what we've been all waiting for. Mm, we're moment, gonna, moment of truth. We're gonna flip it inside out. <laughs> it's like it's like those people what they wear when they're hiking Mount Everest. <laughs> Look at it. Look at that. How beautiful is that, huh? <laughs> wow, it's so fluffy. It's very nice. Well one is done and the quality of the pelt and everything is just beautiful. You cannot see any seams, anything, how it's been done together and we're gonna make a lining, but yeah, the fluffiness and softness and yeah. And do the liner for inside and we are done. Awesome. So Patrick right now is making the liner for inside the mittens and he's doing just awesome job. So we made a liner, we got a nice felt, what we're gonna use is for the liner of the gloves and we got both of our gloves done, they are all done, we got the liners and uh, they fit like a charm inside, so nice. If you guys want, we can make some for you too. We put our liner inside our mittens, we sewed it all around the outside the liner feels so nice in these mittens and these will keep you warm in the winter but also look how beautiful these things look they're the most beautiful things in the world <laughs> and they're so fluffy beautiful if you like our videos please don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell and if you like these mittens don't forget to go to the face our facebook page reels wild contact us and you can buy these mittens from us. Bye.